Hey everyone, welcome back to this channel. Today I want to film this slow fashion secondhand lookbook using pieces that I've gotten from either friends or secondhand online or from thrift shops. There aren't actually many thrift shops here in Malaysia, at least not that I know of, like physical thrift shops, whereas in Vancouver, thrifting would always just be the thing to do, at least for me and a lot of my friends. But what I did recently is I went on this carousel app, which is kind of like Depop, but it doesn't focus on just clothes. Like people would sell all kinds of things like vintage cameras or like just things that they don't want anymore. And that seemed to be quite commonly used in Malaysia. And I've never tried Depop myself, even though when I go back to Vancouver, I probably should. But yeah, Depop doesn't seem very popular here. I feel like people just sell things that are still in trend and still in very much in good condition and they just want to like get rid of these things and like clear out their closet but at the same time they want to make a few extra books out of it so i feel like that's what a lot of like clothes sellers do on carousel and seriously the clothing there is so so affordable and i can just easily find these things that i want at good prices rather than walking into some fast fashion shop and indirectly supporting unethical clothing manufacturers. Nothing feels better than helping someone else clean out their closet and at the same time salvaging items that would otherwise have reached the end of their product life cycle, which is really such a waste. So yeah, I am in love with the Carousel app now and I want to show you some outfits that I can put together using these secondhand items. I haven't decided yet if I want to wear shoes because Asian household, my own room, uh, I don't know how comfortable I am with that. Well, actually, these leggings were also handed down to me from my very good friend, Amanda. So yeah, it fits me well. I like it. It's so comfortable. Okay, so we shall get started. This first outfit gives me an explorer or outdoorsy vibe. It makes me feel like I could be in the bushes hunting Pokemon or something. Or more realistically, doing some outdoor photography. And yeah, I pulled the whole thing together with an old belt that I have. Also, any scars or bruises you might see are due to a skin condition that's now healed. This next outfit is a little white dress. And I think it's quite clear that I'm just straight vibing in this cottagecore aesthetic. Yes! <laughs> But yeah, there I mean there are various aesthetics that I'm drawn to and cottagecore is definitely one of them. Yeah, it definitely embodies the mood that I feel a lot of times, especially when I'm around nature. Okay, manifestation story time. So I was watching Leanne Film's video and she was wearing this Brandy Noble skirt, which I thought was really pretty and it looked like a good length, but I don't really care that much about brands, so I was just thinking to myself, wouldn't it be nice if I had a skirt that was similar to this? And yeah, I was thinking that and just admiring it in a non-desperate way. And the next day I went to search on Carousel and bam, I found a skirt that was a literal dupe of that Brandy Marvel skirt. So yeah, that was really cool. <laughs> And you probably already know this, but you can normally tell it's a dupe when they purposely misspell the brand's name on the clothing tag. And I also got this kimono. I'm not sure if kimonos were more in trend a few years back, uh, more, than, more so than now. But I thought Blackpink did a good job of bringing back the trend. If you've watched their How You Like That comeback stage video, ah, oh, so, so good. And yeah, that was definitely the inspiration behind me buying this. So here I'm trying to tame my relentless baby hair that just never listens to me but it's okay, we just want to look good, not perfect. But yeah, this is a very straightforward outfit. It's just a crop top with some white sweatpants and the top is actually a sports bra but if you ask me, it serves pretty well as a top. And yeah, I think it goes very well with a little sling bag like this. Thank you. 
Lastly, this is a white bodysuit I got from Carousel and I paired it with a grey skirt that I got from, again, Amanda. <laughs> I know, I just vacuum all of my friends' secondhand clothing. But yeah, that's it in this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. I hope it somewhat inspired you to shop more secondhand. I don't remember what I was singing here. I think it's Maroon 5, Sunday morning, I don't know. Also, that's a bodysuit line, not a panty line. And yes, no one is spared from my duck face. But yeah, honestly, thank you so much. I appreciate it. Thank you for being here. I have another video I'm excited to share next Tuesday. So if you want to, feel free to subscribe. Thank you and take care.